Welcome back, everybody. How's it going? D-Dub here. What? I have something in my nose. That's a, that's a big one. Welcome back, everybody. This is D-Dub. Today on the channel, we're opening up some Pokemon cards. I went to a couple stores today. And I wasn't able to find Pokemon Hidden Fates. They're all out. Everybody's just out, apparently. I don't know what to say. It kind of sucks that there's just none in stores. I'm going to go hunting again tomorrow because there's all these new tins out. There's the three new tins that are just like that big with the four booster packs for Hidden Fates. Then there's these new ones, these trainer duos, and those are a little bit different. They don't have Hidden Fates, so the main goal is going to be for Hidden Fates. So with all that said, if you like Pokemon cards, if you like Pokemon card openings, I'm kind of going to be doing that a little bit here on the channel, on D-Dub. Make sure that you subscribe, join the D-Dub Dojo, be part of the hashtag Pika Pack. I am an old school Pokemon fan, and it's been a long time since I've been involved in a hobby, so recently I'm just getting back into it, and I'm enjoying the cards, I'm enjoying watching the videos, I enjoy the Pokemon community kind of just as a whole, and the further that I go down this rabbit hole, the more I'm enjoying myself, so with that all said, Make sure you like the video, and don't forget to subscribe. Be part of the D-Dub Dojo here on a sort of half Pokemon, half video game channel. If that's the kind of thing you guys like, make sure to let me know in the comments down below. I went to stores today, and I did not find Hidden Fates, but I did pick up Unified Minds Sun and Moon Elite Trainer Box. I've seen these around, I've seen these before, and I've never opened one up. So since I couldn't find Hidden Fates, I figured... Let's go ahead and take these medical grade. I used to work at a medical injection molding company and these were the little clippers here that we used to clip medical parts. So I'm going to call these medical grade clippers and we're going to try to get into this box here without damaging it. So I've seen these boxes around. I have a different one over there. I'm probably going to open that in another video. You know, it really is a shame that I couldn't find any hidden fates, but that's okay. And I've watched a few videos. On just exactly is inside these elite trainer boxes and they're actually they're pretty cool so since I couldn't find hidden fates this is what we're doing here today on the channel I'm gonna go ahead and open up this box here I like the art on this I'll probably hang this on the wall it's actually really beautiful looking it's got a lot of nice art on it very colorful very smooth here's that delicious box empty here stuff in here. I like the divider. So that's very cool, just a divider. Of course you can put your cards in the box. Here's more of the contents. Of course we got the Team GX badge along with these poison and healing. Of course we got many, many energy cards. I thought about opening them and just throwing the whole deck, but that would be a little bit too much of a mess to pick up. And I don't, I don't really got time for this. Is the sleeves? These are, these are pretty nice. Let's go ahead and open this. See what kind of quality we have here. Now, I know there's different ones with different Pokemon on them. There's ones that are thicker, a little bit beefier, and better. A lot of people don't seem to like the ones that come in the box, but I don't have any good sleeves. So, and of course we got all these packs here. Got a whole slew of eight different packs that we're going to get into. You of course got your dividers here and we also got the code card. I'll go ahead and leave that. A couple cool dividers. I really dig those. Check them out. Front and back. I really like that. The, the colors and the pattern for the back there. Those are also going to go to the side. Hopefully you got your code card. And then, of course, we got the cool dice, the cool Tag Team GX. You got your poison, little counter here. I, I dig the dice. I like the colors. I like the mixture of pink and white. Those are very cool, very nice to have. And, of course, you just have plain box, good for putting cards in. And I will definitely be putting cards into that box. So, without further ado, we're going to get into some of these cards here. So of course we got the gum shoe and the double aid. And I accidentally forgot to hit record on the first pack opening. So we have this here. 
And then I started to open the second pack. So here's two code cards for y'all. You can have those. The, the backs are different, so I'm not sure what the difference is here. But either way, those can get, this trash can get. Let's get into the second pack that we started opening. So that's this pack right here. I'm gonna do one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four to the front. So we've got a fighting energy. We have recycle energy. We got a thunderous. We have Dragonair, we got a Hone Edge, we got a Sneasel, a Chew, we got a Magnemite, we got a Slacking Sloth, we got a Axew, we got a Magmortar, and yeah! Hell yes! This is going straight into a sleeve. That was one of the cards that I stated that I wanted to pull. That's absolutely going straight into a sleeve. Man, the detail on that is nice. So we got a hit pretty much right off the, the bat, right in the second pack. Okay, let's see if I can get some of that detail for you. I like that stamped sort of effect to it that it's got going. That is a very nice card. And I I gotta be Honest here, I haven't seen these in person yet. I haven't seen any of these full art, these trainers, really pretty much any of these special cards. So we also got the Reverse Magmortar. To just be completely honest, I don't know who Magmortar is. We're gonna open the Mew and Mewtwo Unified Minds. Let's get into this. Let's get some more Good pulls here. We got a, a, a young goose to start with. Here is your code card. One, two, three, four cards. Let's go with lightning energy. It's a fire. So we got a bibarel. Bibarel. Bi barrel. Bibarel. We got a double aid. Oranguru, that's cool. We got a Young Goose. We got a Yanma. We got an Execute. We got a Muckro. We got a Snover. A Reverse Scraggy. And a Zerka Tree. Alright, alright. You know, for, the, for the, the trainer box, I'm definitely very happy to have this card here. So, if we get any more super good hits. Here we will go through this pack right here. I don't even know who those two Pokemon are. As I said, I've been very out of the loop for the past 20 years. I'm starting to learn who some of these new Pokemon are. And it's definitely been quite the, quite the trip, quite the journey. I don't have all the knowledge in the world. Code card right there, one, two, three, four cards. And I'm gonna say Leaf Energy. No, it's a Thunder. So I did that the last time. I'll put that to the side here. We got a Sten Stenny. We got a Double Aid. Ooh, a Channeler. That's kind of a cool little trainer there. We got a Fletchender. Stunfisk. I do not like that Pokemon. I don't think anybody does. We got an Onix. We got a Finneon. We got a Alolan Grimer. He's pretty cool. Ooh, nice Pikachu, and yes! We got a Garchomp and Garatina. That's going straight into a sleeve. That's a very, very nice card right there. Two hits. Two really great hits. Actually, just right off the start. So, we're halfway in here. We got four more packs to go. And if you like this video, like I said, make sure to hit the like button. And if you're new to D-Dub, welcome to the D-Dub Dojo. I'm gonna go ahead and open this pack here. Welcome to the D-Dub Dojo. Where everyone that is subscribed here that likes Pokemon, not everyone here that subscribed like Pokemon, they also do do video games and first looks and different products and stuff like that, mostly for Nintendo Switch. But if you're into that sort of thing, please take a look. And if you're new to the channel, one, two, three, four, at least for tomorrow, there is going to be another unboxing. I have another trainer box. And 
I should also be able to come in contact with some of those new tins. I'm hoping to get like the Gyarados or maybe the Raichu. Maybe I can get both. Maybe I can get like a nice little stockpile going. I need to fill out my Hidden Fates. I need to fill out the Hidden Fates collection. I have a couple pages of a binder going. And so, you know, hopefully we can get some more good pulls from that. So stay tuned for that video tomorrow. It should just release at some point. It might be 8 a.m. Usually I try to do a video the day before and then schedule it. It's not always every day or sometimes it's a little bit later in the afternoon. So be on the lookout for it. If you're new to the channel, I want to welcome you personally. We just hit 100 subscribers, so let's go ahead and get that to 200. Thank you for everyone who's been watching the videos. Thank you for everyone who leaves a comment, who hits the like button. You guys are just awesome and couldn't be more grateful to have a platform to just do silly videos about video games and Pokemon cards and actually get positive feedback for it. So to anyone who watches, anyone who hits the thumbs up, anyone who subscribes, anyone who just shares the video or even just watches a little bit of it, you know, thank you. I appreciate it and without further ado, let's get into the one, two, three. This is the fourth pack. So we got an energy, we got a Heracross, we got a type Null. Now, I, can someone let me know, is that a Pokemon? Like, is his name Null? Or it's a type of card and it's not actually a Pokemon? Very weird. I, I don't know. Stini, Wimpod, we got a Slacking Off Sloth, we got a Salandit, we got a Bon Sweet. Oh, oh. Ooh, Salandit. He's got very nice art. Licky Licky and Magmortar Regular, so... Non-hollow, that's okay. We're gonna keep going here. We got another Mew and Mewtwo. Let's see, we'll leave the Mew and Mewtwo for last. And we'll open this pack right here. The other Mew, I believe, was one of the good ones that had one of the good pulls in it, so... Let's go ahead and just rip right into this thing. Here, of course, is your code card. See ya! One, two, three, four. We're gonna say Metal Energy. And of course, it's not. It wasn't Metal Energy this time. But that's okay. Tranquil. Electric. Pay your electric bill. Reset stamp. We got a Tynamo. We got a Meditite. We got a Noivat, a Sawaddle, a Skaroopy, a Reverse Riolu, a Non-Steelix. That's... that's okay. That's alright, we still got two more packs. One is a Mew, one is Mewtwo. We're gonna save the Mew, Mewtwo for last. We're gonna shred into this pack. This is seven out of eight in a Unified Minds Elite Trainer box. It's very cool to finally get an Elite Trainer box. Open that bad boy up. See just what we got in it. I'm already very happy, actually, with the pulls that I got, which we will be recapping at the end. We got an Energy. We got a Lumineon. Ooh, a Zorma. Zorm, Zormalium. Z Tackle. Zorma. Zorma. Got a Hapu. We got a Hoot Hoot. Hoot Hoot. We got a Scraggy, we got a Numel. I do not really like that Pokemon either. We got a Tynamo, we got a Poipole, we got a Reverse Golisopod, and a Honchkrow, who just deserves to get punched in the face. Nobody likes Honchkrow. From what I've seen, everyone's pulled Honchkrow. Here we are, last pack. Mew, Mewtwo, Hidden... Yeah, Unified Minds Elite Trainer Box. Wish me all the luck. Here's your code card. Push the subscribe button right now and let's focus all the energy so that I can get this great pull, whatever the card is going to be. One, two, three, four to the front. I'm push all these cards back over here. I got a whole pile. I got a whole bunch of energies building up. I got wrappers and trash everywhere, but that's all right. Let's just go ahead and get into it. What is the energy card going to be? I'm going to say leaf. It's a fighting. We got a Magneton. We got a Sableye. We got a Swagloon. We got a Snorunt. We got a Drillbur. We got a Dwebble. We got a Peepy Dove. We got a Mana. Reverse Fracture. And a Serena. 
Hey, Serena, everybody. Evolves from Steamy. So that's just the regular holographic card. And, of course, we did get two pretty good pulls. Not bad. And of course, we did get two pulls, which isn't really that bad from what I've seen from an Elite Trainer box. I think the most I've seen is probably three decent cards. And probably the most I've seen was maybe like four. I haven't watched too many videos, but this seems to, seems to be about your average pull rate per trainer box. Sometimes you just get one full art or decent rainbow rare. Sometimes you don't get anything. So, what did you guys think down below? Was that a decent trainer box? For anybody in the Pokemon community that watches this later down the line, what are your best pulls from this trainer box? What do you guys think? I want to know your opinion down below. This has been D-Dub with, of course, the Unified Minds Elite Trainer Box. I'm starting to get a headache after actually sticking that glue up my nose and using that as the bit during the beginning. So, kids, don't stick that glue in your nose. Like, it's really, like, it's giving me... Uh, maybe I would have gotten a headache otherwise, but it's like one of those, like, behind the, the eye uh, headaches. So, go hit the like button for my headache. Maybe it'll make it go away. Pokemon the cards are fun. I appreciate all the love and support that I get. This video completely so, and of course these videos are just real fun to make. Pulls that here we go. We're quickly show all the I got. So we of course got a Serena full foil. The rest are reverse. We got fracture. Regular Honchkrow, regular Steelix, regular Magmortar, regular Xerxes Tree, regular Gumshoes, reverse Galissapod, reverse Ryolu, reverse Licky Licky, reverse Pikachu, reverse Scraggy, reverse Magmortar, reverse Double Aid, and these two great hits right here. This was probably the one that I wanted the most, so that is just awesome that I actually did pull it. We're going to leave this pile here. Guys, let me know what you think down in the comments below. Have you had any luck with any of these Elite Trainer boxes? Don't forget, tomorrow there's going to be another video of another Elite Trainer box. It's a different kind. We're going to be opening that up for the channel. Hopefully in the next day coming, I'll be able to run to some more of the Mew Mewtwo, Hidden Fates tins, or... So hopefully tomorrow I can run into some of the Mew and Mewtwo pin sets for the Hidden Fates or even just the regular tins, which would personally be better because there's at least four packs in there. So that's four. That's one more chance because the pin set has three booster packs and the tin set has four packs. So it's one more chance to get a great pull. Keep your eyes peeled for that. That is the next video on the channel. So guys, I just want to say thank you. I hope you like this video. If you do, hit the like button and so i just hope that everybody has a good day and i'll see you guys on the next video i suppose i could maybe bend this part back and then just stick it to the wall you can't really save this glue here otherwise i think i might try to put it on the back try to hang it on the wall it's like a giant booger